Hi, I'm Redonna from Boys and Girls Hairstyles. Today I have Sharon with me, um, funnest girl. She's, she's tons of fun. Um, she has been a client for a long time and a good friend. Uh, her haircut is super cute. She has an asymmetrical. Um, so I'm gonna show you her haircut. And then when we dry, you'll see the little purple in her hair. Um, it's super cute. So, okay, so back here, I like to keep this short. So we're just gonna take the length here and then we will take the trimmers and obviously, you know, clean that up. So grab those, clean this up. And Sharon, isn't it once, is it once every four or five weeks that we cut your hair? Is that uh, five? Five, yeah. five, yeah, once every five. But it's fun, she has some curl to it, um, which obviously gives it, you know, some body. And and it's not super curly, but it is a little bit curly and it gives it body, it's super, super nice. But okay, so we just point cut into this top and we make that short. You can see that's a couple inches on the top there. Okay, point cut, and I'm, I'm coming around the shape of her head. And then down here, we're actually going to come in a little bit closer to um, her head, which means I'm having my fingers touch. Let me show you. You can see I'm touching her her head right there so I obviously come up here like I said go around the shape of the head and then when I get back just past this area then that's when I start to angle my fingers down and come a little bit closer to her head we like it shorter here and then kind of stacked a little bit here and coming up to the spiky top. Yeah, Sharon's had all sorts of hair, haven't you, Sharon? I have. <laughs> it's so fun. She's like... Good and bad. <laughs> good and bad. <laughs> oh, that's cute. But yeah, we've... I mean, she's had... She's had the this, this side shave. She's had... Um, kind of a mohawk. She's had it longer, an A-line. Um, this one's probably my favorite on her um, just because it, it suits her personality. Like I said, she's fun. She's, um, anyway, it, it just suits her personality. And so I think that's why I like it even more. But the purple in it adds, um, I was going to tell you guys that anybody out there that is needing a change but doesn't want to either chop it or doesn't dare to do uh, the asymmetrical just like this purple in it and and I'll show you guys when we dry it obviously it it just adds a little um, spunk to it I've had a few ladies do that okay so I'm gonna hold this and then I'm gonna come this way with my shears and make sure that is cut okay perfect and then we'll come over to this side same thing up top just point cut into that she just likes it short and, and messy easy but anyway that's that's what's fun you can add a little purple and and change it up doesn't have to be all over your head but a few weaved in is it does make a difference and it just adds dimension to a haircut. And I do definitely love that. Okay, so you can see I'm still point cutting. Okay, coming down this way. Okay, now um, up top, and I'll wait and show you how to do that hair by the ear in just a second. Okay, up here on the top, just gonna make sure that that's kind of chopped into. And then I'm going to angle up because she likes the front to kind of come longer, um, like mine, like down like this. 
Um, so that's why you want to do it on an angle because when you drop it, this hair drops longer. Okay. So that's, that's why you want to do that. Okay. Angle there. Okay. And now her side, we come over, you can see where I've cut back here. So you're gonna take from that guide point, take that length off, come around this way up to the front and up into this length. And she does like this, you know, obviously shorter because it's asymmetrical, but and I'll show you that in just a second. So you can see I'm coming up, but I'm also gonna leave this part long so it will fall long. Okay, um, like I was saying, she does like this a little bit longer just so she has some to piece out, but obviously not as long as it is now. Okay, so I'm gonna bring this up, that length, up around her ear. Okay, down here, I'm gonna bring some of that length off. A little bit of this length. Okay, so I'm just gonna take a little bit of that off and I'm going to dry this and see um, if we need to take it shorter but I like to dry it first with her curl to see. So if they have curl, um, you can wait to dry it and then see how it's gonna fall. Then if you need more length off, then you can take more length off. Okay, so just holding this out, taking that length off. Okay, and I'm going around her head. And what's awesome is eventually we're gonna come up to this layering up here. See, there's that layering. So you just connect that. So again, down here, you just hold this out, take that length, come up around the head here. Okay, there's those layers. So you just point cut into that. Okay, awesome. All right, now for the bang area, I'm just kind of putting that on an angle. You can see that I'm just point cutting. And then usually after I dry also, I'll come in and kind of texture that a little bit more, uh, but I do like to see it dry. So you can see I'm just kind of taking that up this way. Well, I come down, but <laughs> that's what I meant. Okay, all right. So you can see that it's obviously longer here. Um, and now we're gonna texturize up through here to give it the volume. So I'm gonna texturize down in, and then with Sharon's hair, we definitely want to come back through and do it, uh, the texturizing, through her ends a little bit, not a ton, but a little bit through this top, um, just so it's more PC and more messy. She likes to have movement in her hair. So if you want movement in your hair, definitely do a little bit of this through the ends. I don't love to do that if they don't wear it messy because then you can kind of feel, I just, I don't like it as much. So if you want movement in your hair, definitely do it a little bit through the ends. Doesn't have to be a ton, but a little bit. Okay, now the mousse. I'm gonna take this. You doing good, Sharon? I'm doing great. Okay, awesome. <laughs> awesome, awesome. Just 
enjoying this. Good. I know the little bit of like, see, doesn't that feel good? Yes, it does. <laughs> like the massage. <laughs> okay, then I'm going to spray the volume and lift spray on her. Okay, then I'm going to show you how to dry it. You're just going to dry this back down. Just back and forth with your fingers. just soft like that um, just down um, Sharon likes to just kind of have hers up and messy and we love it that way so you can see I'm just coming in I just clamp it and I pull straight out from the head um, down here same thing through this back area just put it in and you can see I just pull it straight out straight out and straight up okay now I'm just gonna turn her to the mirror so I can kind of see a little bit Just gonna double check. I'm gonna take a little bit more through here. Okay, now I'm gonna take the shiny pomade and I just dig my finger like that. I'm just gonna rub it in my hands to where it's clear. And then her sides, you can kind of piece that out. You can see I'm just grabbing with my, my hands and fingers. Just kind of grab at it. Okay. And then, sorry, I'm gonna turn her to the mirror one more time. I need to see what I'm doing, which I'm going to back comb this a little bit, but I need to see as far as length or anything like that. Okay, do those feel pieced out enough, short enough, your bangs? I, I feel like they should be a tad shorter. shorter. Okay, perfect. Perfect, perfect. So you can always go shorter, but we can't <laughs> put it back on. So this is why I like to do it. We're gonna hold it up this way. Point cut into that. Okay. 
then I'm gonna just come up through, just because it seemed like all the length was on the bottom. So you can see I took little pieces out, up in. Okay, and then once I back comb and stuff, that can be a little fuller through that area. So I'm just coming through, grabbing up the hair, going in, down, and out with a kind of a C shape like that. Okay, and yes, she likes it messy, but not this messy. <laughs> of course, she can pull it off, actually. <laughs> so see, that gives it a little bit of volume through that area. Okay, I'm gonna turn her to the mirror one more time, just to see where we're at. Does that feel better? Mm -hmm. It does. So you can see how cute that is. It's just kind of around her face. Okay, perfect. Now, I'm just gonna go through. Just kind of spray it into place. You, Sharon. You're darling. Okay, all right, awesome. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. Um, hopefully you enjoyed it. I love this haircut. I think it's fun and we will chat next time. Thank you. See ya.